It may be Christmas Eve, but it's also a very historic day for the United States, Paul, you being into NASA and all that. Yeah, this is a big one. 50 years ago, 1968, astronauts Bill Anders, Jim Lovell, and Frank Borman became the first humans to ever leave Earth and travel to another heavenly body. Now, they arrived at our moon on Christmas Eve, and they radioed back to Earth a special Christmas message that I think you're going to find just as meaningful today, 50 years later. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth, and the earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the deep, and the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters, and God said, let there be light, and there was light, and God saw the light, that it was good, and God divided the light from the darkness. And God called the light day. And the darkness he called night, and the evening and the morning were the first day. And God said, Let there be a firmament in the midst of the waters, and let it divide the waters from the waters. And God made the firmament, and divided the waters which were under the firmament from the waters which were above the firmament. And it was so. And God called the firmament heaven, and the evening and the morning were the second day. And God said, Let the waters under the heaven be gathered together into one place, and let the dry land appear, and it was so. And God called the dry land earth, and the gathering together of the waters called he seas. And God saw that it was good. And from the crew of Apollo 8, we close with good night, good luck, a Merry Christmas, and God bless all of you. All of you on the good earth. Christmas Eve, 50 years ago. Speaking of the good earth, uh, Anders, the astronaut, he used a Hasselblad camera to take that picture yes. of Earthrise. And when everybody saw that developed, they freaked out because nobody had ever seen that before. Right, right. Amazing. Just incredible.